This video explains the construction procedure for involute of a circle. An involute of a circle is the locus of the end point of a string as the string either unwind from or wind around the circle. For constructing involute, draw horizontal and vertical center lines, take radius of the circle in the compass and draw a circle, draw a horizontal line from the bottom of the circle, length of the line must be equal to the length of the string that is required to wind the circle for one turn, that is perimeter of the circle. Divide the circle into equal number of parts, for dividing 12 parts, each segment can be marked 30 degrees with the help of a protractor. The line also must be divided into the same number of parts. For dividing a line, another line is drawn from point 1 with an acute angle. Take any convenient distance and mark points on this line. Mark numbers on the divisional points of the circle. While numbering on the circle, it should be done in the clockwise direction. Mark numbers on the divisional points of the line also. The last point should be joined with the end point of horizontal line. Parallel to this, draw lines through all other points. By this, the original line is divided into equal number of divisions. Now, draw perpendicular line from each divisional points of the circle. Measure each of the points distance from the horizontal line. Mark it on the perpendicular line drawn from the corresponding point of circle. That is, measure 1 dash to 2 dash distance from the horizontal line. Mark it on the perpendicular line drawn from the second point of the circle. Similarly, measure 1 dash to 3 dash. Mark it on the perpendicular drawn from third point of the circle. Do it, do it for all the points. Now these points can be joined with the help of a smooth curve. This is the involute. To draw tangent and normal, mark the point on the curve through which tangent and normal is to be drawn. Join that point with the center of the circle. Draw a perpendicular bisector for this line. Draw a semicircle from the midpoint of the line. This semicircle intersects on the circle. Connect that point with the point on the involute. This is normal. A perpendicular line drawn to the normal through the same point is called tangent.